Я кадзи. Hello guys. This one is the Grace of Shenli. It's a range shipment build. Okay, just get six pieces of Grace of Shenli. Let's see what's the uh, effect. <coughs> the first one is a negative effect duration on enemy. 8.2% Armor Retrieve upon range attack 15.9% Range attack guard penetration 19.2% Shooting weapon spirit damage 19.9% A Shenley Heavenly Tome of Tactic When using shooting weapon Increase HP damage deal Okay uh, apply one stack of Shenley uh, Heavenly Tomb of Tactics to any enemy hit with uh, projectiles from shooting weapon. The Shenley Heaven Tombs of Tactics. When an enemy is inspected with two stack of this effect, hitting that enemy with a projectile deactivate the effect while also inflict them uh, with a damage, amplification, power drop and slow. So we just give uh, a lot of debuff for the enemy. Okay. To mix with the Shenry, I choose the inheritor, inheritor of the Tiger. I get a one Halo, one piece of Halo. Uh, how how to see? Uh, okay, one piece of Halo and one piece. Uh, you, because I don't have the tiger hunting bow so i choose blue eye child grief you have the tiger hunting bow just use it because it's uh, deal with more damage so from the effect here is the uh, armor hell max plus two then armor retrieve 9.9 Okay, then the divine beast I use it a uh, Shen Wu. Shen Wu is raise your HP damage for range at, uh, weapon. Uh, this one is replenish. Okay, armor replenish from the Father Strike. Okay, enemy detection. Also apply power drop to the target. Enemy at a range attack hit. Okay, what else? So the main melee weapon is, I use is the Puppet Saber. Uh, I found that this one is very nice. Shifting your uh, drifting cloud. Okay, and jump back. When you jump back, you can use your uh, range weapon. Uh, yeah, you make a distance. Okay, then the second one is the Storm Slash. Okay, when it close, you can use this. Okay, and the third one is a increasing slash. It's a fast slash. Okay. Then okay, let's see the effect I use. 
uh, or uh, you, if I use uh, the eyes and hands, eyes penetration. Remember to get the leg, leg get the attribute damage from attack guarded successfully. Okay. Okay. For the range weapon, just put all the power range attack power, range attack power, armor retrieve upon range attack. Okay, same. Okay, shooting weapon damage. Damage received. Oh, okay. Movement speed increase while aiming. Okay, then all the armor just set the premium shooting weapon damage. Uh, armor retrieve upon range attack. Uh, this armor retrieve only available for the headgear and the uh, gauntlet. Make it two. Then the other take it damage receive to get you more defense. Okay, then armor health max plus one. Okay. Extend spirit disruption duration. Max uh, armor max uh, armor health max plus one. Then the accessory just focus on the armor retrieve upon range attack for premium. Okay. Okay. Then the the um, wizard I use uh, is the frozen sword for a certain period of time and enhance your current shooting weapon with ice. It's very useful. Then frozen splinter also can help you to shoot your enemy generate a spell of ice nearby which runs uh, icy projectiles at nearby enemy spark rice place an electric sphere and emit sparking lightning bow also it help you to shoot enemy mp5 damage for a certain period increase both the damage you deal to enemy and receive from them okay for backup it's a lion roll. William Stair. Dewing Flame. Imposing Slap. Okay. Then let's see the state I have. Wood 40. Fire 119. Earth 30. Mera 40. Water maximum 175. Look at the summary. Uh, just see shooting weapon damage is seventy percent. Oh, then I just show you the important one. Okay. Uh, then the important one is this one. Okay. Armor retrieve upon range attack one hundred point five percent. Okay. So this means you can retrieve your armor every time you shoot. Uh, successful shoot. Okay. Okay. That's all for this build.